Hello people, it's me Ben and welcome to another review and today I'm reviewing the Marvel Select figure Iron Man yeah this time is it's Iron Man time it's a really cool figure from Marvel Select 2 and um, if we do start doing anything else we take a look at the box let me just pick it up here it is. Um, the box was pretty cool. <laughs> Actually, I know it's just a box, but still. Uh, it says Iron Man as usual over there on the side. It has the Marvel Select logo. God comes with the Marvel Select icon right there. And we have this book or thingy right there. We show you the other Marvel Select figures and stuff. We have a pretty cool picture of Iron Man right there. Ah. Pretty cool. On the back, back, there's some other Marvel Select figures. And Iron Man, of course. We got Captain America. We, and we have the Hulk. And uh, there's also some bio. Alright there <clears throat> facing a troublingly unpredictable future Tony Stark continues to fight evil and injustice as Iron Man one of the most powerful powerful superheroes in the world um, with new weapons technologies threatening to spread across the globe on shift only the invincible Iron Man has the knowledge abilities and education to use in a new age of prosperity of prosperity for all the people of the earth. So that was pretty cool. Now let's just have a uh, look at the Iron Man himself. Now this figure is really cool. Let me just get the camera a little further in. You can see. This Iron Man is either from the Invincible Iron Man. Uh, uh, the Invisible Iron Man, um, you know, oh, what's it called? Series, TV series. There we go. Or the Iron Man Two movie. I, this is actually not a movie figure, so I think it's from the Invisible Iron Man TV show. But I'm not really sure. Uh, it also comes with base, of course. Comes with this plate thingy. I don't really know what it is, but it has two pigs. <clears throat> got purple or pink or something around there don't really know what it is but who cares it also comes with this thing this one is pretty cool actually it's like Iron Man is going to be up here and uh, you see one of my pigs has been has uh, been broken off it came so out of the package but doesn't really matter. Here we have some. It's pretty cool actually. It's like stones or smoke or anything. I think it's stones. Stones has been exploded away or something. And then we have this fire, which I guess it's like the fire from Iron Man boots. Iron Man's boots. And um, it's actually pretty cool. It's like yellow and orange and red all mixed together. So, well, the base is pretty cool too. And also, up here, I guess it's some kind of smoke thingy going on. Um, and of course we have this only pig. Now to the Marvel, uh, to the Iron Man figure himself. Um, if we start off with the details, it's pretty much details on this guy. <clears throat> we, have the, we have the head, first of all. The head sculpt, it's the classic um, head on him, I guess. And uh, the head sculpt is pretty cool, also. It's, yeah, the classic Iron Man head, I guess. We have this triangle thingy, which means it's from the Invisible Iron Man uh, TV show. Uh, we have this. Um, Muscle definition in the 
armor, which is pretty cool. I like, they could have done more details on this guy, on the armor, you know. But well, they didn't, so there's nothing to complain about. The hands is pretty cool too. Um, let me just see if the camera can pick it up. We got this. Oh god, we have this uh, laser shooting blob right there. And uh, the head is like molded like this, so you can't really uh, move. But that uh, doesn't really matter to me. Um, now to the legs. I don't know if there's so much details on this. It's like only this split it up things down on the boots where the feet comes but otherwise than that I'm not really sure if there's any more details on this guy which I pick up as good or you know what I mean now to your articulation <clears throat> you could have gone with more articulation I guess but well the head can go up like that much actually I thought it would go up further when it's flying like Whoa, looking down, you know, but who cares? <clears throat> he can look down. His head goes a little to the sides. Pretty much just to the left, actually, but right. Uh, uh, right from your left. Uh, left and right. <laughs> now, um, he got a ball joint on his shoulder, which means he can go up. Down or in and out, and uh, forward back. He has a ball jointed elbow, same there, forward back, in and out. And uh, the hand is not a ball joint, it's just a swivel hand. And this is it, no articulation in the fingers or anything, but that doesn't really matter too much. <clears throat> Get a waist movement. Um, you got a ball jointed legs or ball jointed hips. You can go in and out, forward back, as you know. And I think they're actually kind of crazy about these ball joints on this guy. Um, he has it in the um, knees too. And uh, yes, yeah, in there, in and out, forward back. And he's also have a little, little up here. I don't know if the camera can take it up, but well, but that doesn't can go to the sides. It can just go in, forward, back, pretty much like that. So I guess that was pretty much about that guy. Now, um, if we try to stand him on these on this peg. Let's see how it goes. Now he's only got one feet to stand with. Oh god. <laughs> this is cool in a way. Just like that. He's taking off. Um, oh, I guess it was pretty much about that guy. Let's have a size comparing. <laughs> Let me just pick some of these up. Let's go for the Marvel Select Captain America, the first Avenger figure. Um, if we can stand them together. They got pretty much about the same size. But, you know, Captain America still stands with these. Um, legs in this in that position. I don't really know what I could say about that. And uh, Iron Man has these straight legs, but still they're about the same size. So yeah, actually I bought the this guy, the Iron Man figure, because uh, I wanted to get the whole Avengers collection. But so I I I did. Uh, uh, Actually, I didn't really want this guy, but when when I've been looking on him and you know stuff, um, 
I have to take back everything I said. This is a damn sick figure. Um, it's <laughs> it's one of the best I got actually. Well, I know there's better Iron Man's out there, but still, for a Marvel Select, this is an awesome figure. So, uh, yeah, I guess that was pretty much about the Iron Man figure. Um, I go to do a review sometime next week, I guess. This is Saturday, I'm gonna upload it today. So, um, I, I actually recommend pick this figure up if you want the you know, um, Avengers collection, and, um, well, I get, I gave Iron Man a five of, uh, four or five stars, and, uh, yeah, as I said, pick this feature up, and I'll see you later, peace.